had a dad who brought his baby girl up here and sat down here and mom was sitting back here about where Jackie is and you know what the baby girl wanted to be with her mom right do you remember like wanting to be with your mom or dad and feeling bad when they weren't there or the somebody else yeah okay sometimes it's a sometimes it can be hard to be alone and it's even harder when it's our own friends or people who are close to us who not just leave us alone, but hurt us, you know? So there's an interesting story about Jesus. On the night before he dies, he and his disciples are at a, at a garden where there's a bunch of olive trees. I've been to that garden, and the olive trees in there now are huge. It's amazing how big they are. And Jesus is praying, and he says to his disciples, watch with me and pray with me. I'm going to go over here and pray, but you guys watch and pray over here. Jesus prays, and he comes back, and guess what's happened to his disciples? Oh, they're still there, but they've fallen asleep. They're sleeping on them. Because it's late at night. And you know, sometimes you ever close your eyes to pray, and then you wake up, and it's morning? Woo! And so, gee, that happens... Yeah, yeah. Well, you can pray at nighttime. It's, it's a great way to go to sleep is to pray and fall asleep. But Jesus wanted them to stay awake, and he, and he woke them up. Hey, guys, come on. Pray for a little uh, Pray with me for a little while. And he goes off and he prays again, and you know what they do again? Fall asleep. Fall asleep again. Oh, goodness. When it is all done and Jesus is finished praying, he comes back to them. They're sleeping again, and then somebody else shows up. It's one of the disciples who's not with him. It's one of Jesus' best friends, his friend Judas. And one of his best friends, Judas, has made arrangements to help Jesus be arrested. Can you imagine that, a best friend doing that to, to someone? That's awful. And he comes to Jesus, and you know how he greets him? He greets him like he's a best friend. He gives him a kiss on the cheek. Which in, in the ancient world, that was a normal way you would greet your best friend. And then there was a crowd of people there to arrest Jesus. Jesus went with them, he's arrested, and you know what? The rest of his disciples did. They ran away so they could be safe. And so one of Jesus' friends has abandoned him and had him arrested. And the other friends have abandoned him by running away. And now he's alone. That's awful. I have never been alone like that, and I'm really glad for that. But it's a really tough thing that Jesus went through. Will you guys say a prayer with me? Will you bow your heads with me and repeat after me? Dear God, we thank you for Jesus. We thank you for his love for us. We thank you that he never leaves us. Amen. Amen. Now, we have worksheets for you. And so we're going to hand those out. And we've got some pe people we're going to recruit to hand those out.